this is Venus. Venus is just mischief on legs. If there's anything that can be played with, fiddled with, um, or anything else, she'll be there doing it. I expect while I stand here, she'll probably have a play with the bits of rope hanging on the crush behind her. She usually does. But I thought I'd show you Venus today because Venus has the colouring of a vicuna. Vicunas are the wild ancestors to alpacas. There isn't such thing as a wild alpaca. So um, they're fully domesticated and um, have come from the vicuna. So a vicuna is a smaller animal. It only has about um, half a kilo of fiber when it's shorn and they don't need shearing every year. Every three or four years is fine. And they don't die if they're not shorn. So their fiber's really fine, probably around 13 microns. I think it's the finest fiber in the world. There's her mum, Daisy, very, very similar coloring. And vicuna um, garments and things like that are some of the most expensive um, naturally made fibers that you can buy because it comes off in such small amounts. Vicunas, I think, are wonderful. You can just see there that um, Venus has gone back into the crush to get some extra food. So vicunas um, aren't able to live in the in captivity. They're very, very nervous, and um, so they don't adapt to captive living at all. Whereas alpacas, as you can see, are pretty good at it. So um, there you are. There is no wild alpaca.